So you're looking to trailer your boat for the first time. What I would try to do is get the boat on the water and get you a little familiar with it. Put it in gear at least and just go straight. See where the center part of the steering wheel is and then you kind of want to turn all the way right. It's like one and a half turns to the right and then, a, and then another like one and a half turns to the left. And that's important because when you're going at a really slow speed like this, when you're going onto the trailer, you want to know where the rudder is. If you have the rudder in the wrong spot and then you kind of hit the gas a little bit, you're gonna move in the wrong spot and you just have to be perfect to get it on the trailer really well or else you see those people who are doing like some perpendicular thing and it just looks super hectic and they freak out. You know, you just don't wanna do that. So <laughs> what I would recommend is if it's windy too, I would take down the bimini. This is like a sail, uh, but it's kind of a smaller detail. You want to also know how your boat goes in reverse, depending on if it's right or left. The easiest way to tell is just to go in a straight line and then just put it in reverse a little bit. You can see from the horizon on the screen that um, I'm, I'm moving back to the left a little bit. So what that means is since I'm moving to the left, I want to hug that right pillar on the side of my trailer. So then when I start getting there and I get closer to the trailer, I'm going to hit reverse and I'm just going to barely move around that pillar like this. So I'm coming at the pillar and then I hit reverse and I move my butt backwards and then I'll slide through. It'll be nice and easy. You've heard that saying, slow and steady wins the race. This is definitely true for this case. We're just gonna take it nice and easy. This, you don't wanna uh, ruin anything. You don't wanna hurt your trailer. You don't wanna hurt your boat or hurt anyone else. So just go nice and easy. There's no reason to ever just like hit the gas super hard. Like you can see people just like hit, hit in reverse super hard. Um, it's all, it's just very casual and calm next to the trailer. So you probably want to be about a hundred feet out and line up. And when I'm really far away like this, I am basically pointing my front nose on the right side uh, pole right there because what my bow is going to do is it's going to come back over. And then when I get super close to it, I'm going to start turning left. And then I'll put it in reverse and I'll slow down and it's gonna straighten me out. This is just a little bit of practice to get used to, but once you kind of figure it out, you know, it really starts helping. I'm over exaggerating this a little bit so uh, you can see it a lot better, but I'm gonna come in at an angle, nice and slow. You can see I've only put it in and out of gear. I haven't like hammered it or anything. And then right when I come to that point, I'm going to put it in reverse, and you can see it just straightens me out perfectly, and I'm going to slide right into those pillars. Nice and easy. And once you're through those pillars, you've done a pretty good job. Bring the trailer up, get your guy to hook up the boat, and you're set. Check out my other videos on this boat. If you're interested, feel free to subscribe. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it, and we'll see you next time.